Hey, hey, lovers. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm showing you how I made this cake for my convocation in November. This cake, this video is highly required and that is what I'm showing you today. So, if you want to see how I made this cake, please stay tuned. Okay guys, this is my cake recipe. I usually use 450 grams of sugar, 500 grams of butter, 10 pieces of egg, 500 grams of flour, baking powder, a teaspoon, and vanilla, a tablespoon. So I leave some tips for you guys. And um, now I have already baked my cake. I didn't film that guys. So this, is, this I'm showing you is all I could film. Um, I've already baked my cake and I've coated it using sugar, icing sugar and butter. I didn't use any particular measurement guys. And next I am going to be making my fondant which I am going to be showing you. So I'll be making use of this icing sugar and um, CMC and I'm showing you the recipe for my fondant on the screen as you can see right now that is the measurement i usually use then sometimes i have to multiply or divide depending on the size of the fondant i am making so i'm going to be making use of these tools and some other ones that are not in this video now i am done making my fondant all i basically did was mix all those um ingredients together and knead them to form um a dough so now i've, I've already colored my fondant using different colors i usually use wilting colors and that is what i'm showing you guys right now so i use that black for the black fondant i use blue to achieve the light blue and the dark blue the dark blue i just add a few drops of black color to achieve the dark blue then the red color i use wilton red food color to achieve that and the white i just do not add any color to it that is the color you uh defaultly achieve when you mix all those ingredients together so guys i've already rolled my fondant using the rolling pin and i use my measuring tape to cut different sizes of um, the road fondant and i covered the cake so this you're looking at is like the foundation covering so i did that for all the pieces of cake that i have and um after that i'm going to be covering with the propel um colors that i have colors of fondants that i have already done so this is the red i did this in um different um two different rectangular shapes because i'm doing a simple book cake guys so this one too i cut it into i sh i used the measuring tape to measure the length and breadth of the cake then i cut the fondant into that size so guys i used um alphabet cutter to achieve to cut these shapes guys for the letterings that will be on the cake and um afterwards i'm going to be using them on the cake so guys i've already covered the cake with the fondant that i i cut earlier and i'll go ahead to stick the letterings on the red and black cake so the other one is made for a client it was ordered for um the same convocation too so i made to cake on that date um basically the same book cake but different colors so guys i'll be going ahead to stick the the letterings on the cake i usually use a brush i'll tap it in water 
and 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 put it on the other side of the lettering and stick it to the cake and later i'm i'm using this um this dust it is called dust we call it dust in nigeria guys i don't know why it is called in other part of the world but in this place if you walk up to any cake shop and you say you want to buy dust it is available in different colors so i bought the gold of it and i mix it in edible spirit and i'm using a brush with tiny mouth to apply it on the letterings just to give it um, the color the gold color that you can see as i'm doing it guys so that is basically how i achieve that and um i let it sit to dry it basically dries as you are applying it because the edible spirit tends to evaporate as you are using it so guys this is the outcome and um i know it is not as detailed as it should be guys um I had some challenges doing proper videos while I was doing this cake. But guys, I assure you I will be in the comment section. If you have any questions, I'll be right there to answer your questions, guys. I'll be waiting for you. Please ask me questions. Um, let me know what you think about the video. Let me know what you think about the cake. And um, I'm going to be showing you the outcome of the other cake too. So guys... Thank you guys for always stopping by on my channel to check out on my new videos. I love you guys and I would never take you for granted. I would never ever take you for granted guys. I love you and I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And um, don't forget to leave me a comment in the comment section. Love you. Bye.